to story time at Aaron's house. I'm so happy that you guys are here. You already know on this channel, we love to read books. I love reading books to you. So today we are going to read The Very Quiet Cricket by Eric Carl. All right, guys, if you have a copy, grab your copy. If you don't have a copy, just follow along. Let's go. One warm day from a tiny egg, a little cricket was born. Welcome, chirp a big cricket, rubbing his wings together. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together, but nothing happened, not a sound. Good morning, whizzed the Lucas, spinning through the air. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together, but nothing happened. Not a sound. Hello, whispered a praying mantis, scraping its huge front legs together. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together, but nothing happened. Not a sound. Good day, crunched a worm, munching its way out of an apple. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened, not a sound. Hi, bubbled a spittle bug, slurping in a sea of froth. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened, not a sound. Good afternoon, screeched a cicada, clinging to a branch of a tree. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together, but nothing happened. Not a sound. How are you? hummed a bumblebee, flying from flower to flower. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together, but nothing happened. Not a sound. Good evening, whirled a dragonfly gliding above the water. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together, but nothing happened, not a sound. Good night, buzzed the mosquitoes, dancing among the stars. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together, but nothing happened, not a sound. A luna moth sailed quietly through the night, and the cricket enjoyed the stillness. As the luna moth disappeared silently in the distance, the cricket saw another cricket. She too was a very quiet cricket. Then he rubbed his wings together one more time. And this time he chirped the most beautiful sound that she had ever heard heard. There are 4,000 different kinds of crickets. Some live underground, others above, some live in shrugs or trees, and some even live in water. Both male and female crickets can hear, but only the male can make a sound. By rubbing his wings together, he chirps. Some people say that it sounds like a song. Hey y'all, welcome back. Did you guys enjoy the book? I most definitely enjoyed this book. I actually have a whole playlist for Eric Carl books. They're right down there below. You just look for it and it's all there. I absolutely love his illustrations and I really enjoyed reading this book to you guys. Don't forget to let mommy and daddy know to give this channel a like and subscribe or even share. I post every week sometimes twice a week, so we can read together. Don't forget to like and subscribe. All right, guys, I will see you guys later. Bye.